Hey YouTube, so this is the look I'm going for today and it is inspired by the Toy Story little alien guys in the little, in the Disney the Disney's the Disney movie Toy Story, the little alien guys. <laughs> um but it's fun and it's crazy and I really really like it a lot. I like it a lot. <laughs> I'm sorry, just ignore my hair. It's not cute today at all but so anyway I hope you guys like this um don't forget to comment rate and subscribe all right catch you later all right so the first thing we're using is milk from um NYX and we're just putting it all over the lid and this will help with um the green and the white looking a little bit better a little bit more pigmented and make it last a little bit longer now a lot of people don't do this, but I am just um, blending it out a little bit. Most people would do this with their fingers, um, but because I have nails, this works better for me. Um, and I'm always trying to get rid of every little ex excess makeup <laughs> that falls. Don't I look cute? So now I'm just taking Moonlight from Beauty from the Earth and it's just a sample one that I got and all I'm doing is just pressing it down on the inner corner of my eye um, and then I'm taking Rant from Beauty from the Earth, also another sample that I bought. I'm putting it on the rest of my lid and just blending, it, blending the two together and also in with the NYX as well. The NYX milk pencil that we just used. Make sure to blend out that white and that green very well or else it looks a little bit funny. And make sure to cover all that milk. <laughs> all that milk. <laughs> okay. So now we're just gonna take a, a eyeliner pencil or brush and we're going to just create a sh uh, crease. And I'm just using just an, any black, any black will do. Um, and this will help with making everything a little bit more cut and more defined. And you just wanna make sure to blend everything out very well. That's my biggest pet peeve is to blend I'm kind of a perfectionist when it comes to my makeup I feel like everything always has to be perfect so now I'm just taking a different brush and just kind of darkening it um, darkening the black and blending everything in a little bit more I keep looking up because there's a mirror up a, like in front of me, so <laughs> it looks like I'm looking up at the sky, but I'm really not, I promise. And a, with the look, we're going for like an alien type of look, so we want that cut crease on the, on the side of your eye. Um, it just gives it a little bit more um, of not an alien look, but more creative, I guess. Now what we're gonna do is just go over the bottom of my eye with the same thing. So we're just gonna use the moonlight for the first part and then the rant um, on the other, on the most of the eye, the bottom. <laughs> and just clean it all up you don't want it to be like all the way down your face you want to just have a little t a little showing not too too much so just clean it up as best you can
And we're also just going to put a little, little green part on the side as well to kind of give it even a little bit more edgier look to it. Um, you don't have to do this, but I just kind of came up with this for the moment type of thing. Um, then I'm just going to fill in my eyebrows. My least favorite part, I hate my eyebrows. I feel like they don't match with each other, but it's whatever. Just clean everything up. Make sure you have no brown away from your eyebrows. That would look kind of funny. Um, and then we're just going to use, I don't like using highlighted colors, so we're just going to use kind of like a natural color and it's called Champagne Fizz. And it's a matte color from Maybelline and we're just going to fill in the rest, um, highlight, highlighted part and above the brow or below the brow bone <laughs> and just make everything look nice. So this is the final look. I did mascara, eyeliner, and then eyeliner at the bottom, top, everything. So I hope you guys like it. And then I'll also have some pictures of all the products that I used.